We mentioned some sponsors. Without them, we couldn't do this particular thing. And so we'd like to invite Alicia Moulton. I'm so happy to have her. She is a bo she's a Sajikor boss mom. Alicia Moulton White, to be specific. Sajikor thinks big. Sajikor's big donation. We're going to get into it. And by the way, she's absolutely fabulous. So I need to take in this moment. We need to give her a moment. A moment. <laughs> we need to give her a moment. Alicia. Hi, honey. How are you? You look. Or hi, mommy. Listen. <laughs> Sajikor. Yes. Alicia. Yeah. You look beautiful. Thank you so much. Mommy so of, do you. Thank you. Mommy of three. Three. And Three. recently announced as the VP of marketing. I am. For the subject. Oh, can we get a hook? Oh. <laughs> yeah, we have to pick up the boss moms, you know. When we see women doing, yes, it's people them giving us the, the spirit fingers and all of that. When we see women doing well, the idea is not to look at them as a competition or say, oh, she go on like, but to say, yes, girl. Thank you, you. You worked for it. And you know that if we as women did that a little bit more, knowing what we go through, mm -hmm. this last year has been hard. Imagine. For many, many women, listen, it's hard enough being woman in business and all that comes with that. Correct. But when you think of being a boss at your home of your children and at work and with your the layers, oh the layers. layers and the emotions that come with it, it's, it's hard. So we need to encourage each other. You're right. Yeah. Uh, but you make so it thank very, you. You make it look very effortless. I know, I know this is just a chit chat and I don't <laughs> have a lot of time. But, you know, Sajikor has become, re, um, you know, known. It, it has built a reputation on always giving back. You know, community and corporate social responsibility is very important. And I heard about the donation that you made yeah, for, well, for Boss Mom. Well, I'll, I'll say a little bit about the reason we are like that. I know that <laughs> I saw a tweet one day. So, Sajikor just makes money and then just gives it away. <laughs> what, is, I, what is that? And I laughed. I chuckled to myself. But then I think of our mission and our vision as a company. And it's to be a great company. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Improving the lives of the people in the communities in which we operate. And when I started at Sajikor 10 years ago as an assistant manager, it was ingrained in me mm -hmm. that if the people in the communities in which you operate are not prospering, forget it. You are not going to be successful. And especially in Jamaica and a country that needs so much help, yes. it's our pleasure to, to just focus a little bit on moms for a little bit. We, we've had a rough year. Mm -hmm. uh, Mother's Day is coming up. It's huge. Yes. And when Michelle, as usual, called us and said, I have this thing. Can you help? And I said, well, you know we'll support you. Uh, but the, the, the catalyst for us to always help is the fact that B3 boss mom always wants to give back. Correct. There are mothers who are worrying about meals for their children. Can you imagine that? Correct. If your child is hungry, you feel it. Correct. And, and, and they are frustrated. And their, their frustration is immense. So we were just very happy to, to give $700,000 mm -hmm. worth of gift grocery vouchers Beautiful. to some moms uh, selected by the, the B3 Boss Mom team. Mm -hmm. I pray that it will go a long way. I pray every woman I know, Tonar Han Fashan. Yes. And I pray that this will go a long way for those mothers who are in need. Thank you. Thank you, Alicia. And I'm going to stick in. I'm going to squeeze in <laughs> a question because sure. you, you represent hope in many yeah, sure. ways. And for persons who may not know your story, um, you know, I've, I've, I've always done my research and I've always um, admired you. Um, not just your rise in your career, but even as a mom, because we are speaking about mom. And at the beginning, I said that it's not necessarily for all biological moms. They're, they're, they're women yeah. who are in our circles, co-workers, colleagues, some who might be watching right now who've been trying right. and have tried. And I know that you've been through um, your I experience. Have, I have. I've, I'm a mom who has suffered the loss of three children. Yeah. So two of my children uh, were miscarriages and I still call them my children. Yes, and you named them. I did. And one of them was not a miscarriage but rather a stillbirth and her name is Faith Hope White. Now, when the nurse came after I had given birth to her and she was dead and she said, "You know, you're going to have to name her and call the funeral home." And so she, I looked at her like she was like she had 10 heads. Yes. I was like, "What are you talking about?" However, you na we named her my husband and myself Faith Hope so that we would always remember Mm -hmm. the faith that we had to have her yes. and the hope that we can carry on. And I encourage mothers yes. 
to continue to have faith and hope in this journey. There are many ways to have a child yes. nowadays. And we are stuck a lot in Jamaica with the traditional ways. And this may be controversial, but hey, you know. Yeah, we let's explore. Let, let's, let's, let's talk about it. Yeah. Let's, let's talk about it. Let's see what we can do to become mothers to those who are unwanted. Correct. Mothers to, to un, unborn children. And also pray. Seek, seek the Lord. Seek help. Seek the support of your friends. Mm -hmm. Seek help. The village. And, and talk about it. I remember a lady at the elevator at Sajakor one day. She said, oh, my darling, I'm so sorry about what happened to you. You know, I lost eight children. So, no, if you had shocked me with a stun mm. gun, I wouldn't have been able to. I mean, what do you mean? But then it's not something people talk about. Right. But there is faith and there is hope. And you have to channel that. You're not, And you're not... You're not, something is not wrong with you either. Yeah. Mothers. There so are even the language, even the language oh, that we use with ourselves and with uh, others. And so we have to be sensitive to other women so as well. So how are you to make that happen to you? We have to be sensitive. Thank you. Um, Thank you. Uh, on that note, and that was beautifully said, I, I definitely, and I will leave um, our, our viewers with this. You know, you said that you had to pray about it, but you had to release it unto the Lord. Sure. So sure. that you are now open to embrace. And so even as we are going through very challenging times, it's a phrase I'm I going have now, to by use, the way, release for renewal. Well, there you go. And so even though there's a pandemic, there's frustration, there are challenges, job losses, job cuts, your know, salary cuts, we're going to release it mm -hmm. and we're going to welcome the renewal. Alicia Moulton White. Thank, thank you. you, boss mom. <laughs> Boss, babe, <laughs> boss, everything. Thank you very much to you Thank and you. for Sajikor for always supporting such amazing causes. I, I hope I'll see you on Saturday as we go on the road and we do all of our giveaways. That is going to be great. All right. Thank <laughs> you. I hope you guys will just drop your emojis, drop your applause, because we want to definitely uh, continue to celebrate and encourage our, our women in society. who.